What is up guys? Welcome on back to TK's Garage and you guys have been asking me for this for a little bit and it's time to give you an update on the Green Monster. into TK's Garage and today we're going to talk a little bit about the Green Monster and why the original, the original frame and shell of the original car is actually going back up for sale at Copart. That's right, Copart. Um, for, for all you guys that haven't followed the process, there's been a few different things that have gone on with purchasing, you know, a donor vehicle from IAA. And then picking up another vehicle uh, in a similar fashion. And with the salvage title, and that's that's the issue. The other two vehicles are able to have clean and clear titles. And I know you're going to say, but that's crazy. The other vehicles have way more damage. I know. They do. Um, but the original Green Monster, the 2020 Dodge Challenger Scat Pack Manual has a branded salvage title. Now, if you haven't been keeping up with the market, recently, the market has proverbially, and that sounded retarded, <laughs> crashed. Um, the market is, you know, taking into, a, into effect, you know, inflation, inventory, even though there's still not a lot of new vehicles being manufactured, um, everything is just so inflated that stuff has started to come down. Wholesale auctions are dropping like a rock. So, I need to try to recoup some of the money from the other two, and I'm still going to have the same thing. Now, some people are going to say, well, TK, well, what about the engine and transmission? Keeping that. Uh, the vehicle, which you guys will get a lot number and a listing for for Copart is going to be with no engine and transmission it's literally a rolling shell um, with the driver's seat <laughs> that's it no electronics no PCM nada nothing everything else has been taken from the vehicle um, including including the instrument cluster like everything all right the whole the whole thing um some of those parts are i'm gonna sell on ebay some of them will be used in the final version of the street legal green monster um and the other one will be used and i don't even know if i'm gonna do that hell of a great job in fixing the body stuff on it because it's gonna be a track car both will have clean titles and um What's crazy is, believe it or not, when both are done, one will be an automatic, one will be a manual. I mean, that's right. I know people ain't going to like this, but the automatic is going to be the one that's the track car, and the manual will be my daily driver. Um, the automatic scat pack has, I think, more damage, you know, body damage, but has lower miles. And the manual, the reason why that's going to be the daily driver is because I'm going to have a whole another six-speed transmission. I'm going to put my upgraded rear end that came from the Monster, and that's the only thing that will be swapped will be that rear end. And the Green Monster will go with a rear end and a drive shaft, but just no transmission, no engine. So um, You guys will get a chance to see that here soon, as I should be on the East Coast for a very short amount of time i need to move some furniture and some other stuff that i want out here on the west coast out here so you guys will get to see that um as far as monster monster 2 or green monster 2 um progress on that vehicle is coming along well and i was gonna say by the time i'll put the images in here but i think what i'll do is for my members i'll go ahead and drop some images of the progress from the body shop in the members only tab for the members and then i'll do a career i'll do a post and i'll put those images in here for you guys later and if you're following me on instagram or getter g-e-t-t-r um i'll drop them over there as well but anyways 
there's your update. That's what's going on with the green monsters. Monsters, I guess I should say. Uh, the original monster is actually going to go run back through Copart just because branded title is a branded title, man. Branded title is a branded title. And uh, having two other ones that are clean titles just hold their value more, and one of them had to go. And uh, I know some people will be like, well, is this the original? The original heart, the engine and transmission, the built motor, the rear end, all that stuff is going into my main daily driver. So there's nothing to worry about there. And the track car, I'm debating whether I want to buy the 1320 stuff for that car and you know maybe maybe even go crazy with the transmission i don't know yet we'll see uh and there'll be a different post and so anyways let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below there you guys have it you guys have been hounding me about the green monsters and um i will have a purple heart update for you guys very soon and for you guys that have been just beating it into my brain for the last six months about the gto yep video on that as well um i'm consolidating a lot of stuff and it's because i'm about to make a massive purchase more on that on the next one peace oh and before i gotta go to give the major before I go, I have to give a major shout out to the sponsor of today's video, LosMobileUSA.com. Definitely go check them out. Doesn't matter what carrier you want to use. Like I said, supported me when I was overseas. Data worked great when, I, when there was towers that were standing and weren't blown up. Yay! Uh, but worked great for me in Europe. Worked great for me everywhere I go. LosMobileUSA.com. Use the coupon code TK's Garage. They're going to look out for you. My members, there is a bigger discount for you guys in that members only section. Go check that out. And uh, yeah, catch you guys on the next one.